So it's the movie The Matrix, man. You know, this movie is about, what, 20 years old or older? You know, and when this first came out, you know, I, I was just, I just watched it for the action pretty much, you know, gun action, him dodging the movies and the, uh, the bullets in slow motion, you know, things of that nature. Um, but, you know, you watch it again today and you see that it, you know, this movie was pretty deep, man. It was really deep, you know, it was before its time, you know, and it's still relevant today. And, you know, it's actually had a lot of biblical references too, man. You know, and you can see in this clip right here, you see this guy, you know, this slimy heathen, you know, this guy represents Judas, man. And, you know, he's sitting at the table with the wicked, negotiating a deal to turn in, you know, his, uh, you know, the people in the circle, man, you know, that he, that he called friends, you know, and that's what, that's what they're going to do, man. They're always going to use somebody within your circle, whether you believe it or not, to take you down, to betray you, man. You know what I mean? You know, uh, uh, um, somebody that, that's not strong, man. They think they're strong, but they're, and actually they're weak. When, when, you know what I mean? When that spotlight gets shined on them, you know? Because they're all, you know what I mean? They're always carnal, carnal minded. But in this table, I mean, in this, uh, this clip right here, you see that um, he's uh, negotiating a deal with the wicked and he's telling them what he wants. And it reminded me of exactly how these guys, you know, betrayed us. You know, they tell them, they tell them, you know what I mean? These guys told them what they want. You know what I mean? Hey, you're going to get your record of sponge. Hey, we can get you a new car. Oh, you know what I mean? We can get you some money. You know what I mean? Or whatever they promised them, man. You know, and they wanted, they wanted, you know what I mean? They wanted us, man. That's who they wanted, you know? And they sold us out, man. You know what I mean? But, you know, they couldn't see the bigger picture, man. You know what I mean? You know, they couldn't see the bigger picture. And it's sad because this guy right here, he was actually wo awoken up to the truth, man. But he wanted to go back into the, um, you know, the false reality. You know, the fake world, man. He wanted to go back into the Matrix, you know, because the Matrix, you know what I mean? It wasn't real, man. It was, a, it was just a fake program, but he loved it, man. He enjoyed it. And that's like a lot of these, these Freemasons and people that's awoken to the truth that have already sold out, you know. <laughs> you know, they enjoy it, man, because, they, you know, they already got the reward here on this earth, man. So they don't care, you know. They don't care, man. And that's, it's sad, you know. So you're going to see in this clip what I'm talking about, you know. Do we have a deal, Mr. Reagan? You know, I know this steak doesn't exist. I know that when I put it in my mouth, the Matrix is telling my brain that it is juicy and delicious. After nine years, you know what I realize? Ignorance is bliss. Then we have a deal. I don't want to remember nothing. Nothing. You understand? And I want to be rich. You know, someone important. Like an actor. Whatever you want, Mr. Reagan. Okay. You get my body back in a power plant. Reinsert me into the Matrix. I'll get you what you want. Access codes to the Zion mainframe. No, I told you I don't know them. I can get you the man who does. Morpheus. Well, in the last clip, you see that he said he's been awoken to the truth for uh, about nine years. You know, he knew the truth. And pretty much, you know, he wanted to live in ignorance, man. He didn't want to, he didn't want to know the truth. You know, and in this ship right here, the ship that they were in, that to me, it kind of represented the wilderness, man. The wilderness. You know, remember when um, the Israelites left Egypt and they went into the wilderness you know, that pretty much was a test right there, you know, because all of them couldn't go into the, uh, you know, to the promised land. Because there was a lot of, it was a lot of um, fake people with them that was going to, you know I mean, corrupt the promised land when they got there, you know, because they wasn't true. So, you know, he was been working for nine years and this ship right here that they were in, he didn't like it because that's the wilderness, man. So he was being sifted out just like the Moses sifted, um, you know, the, the, uh, the, um, the weak risen rice out from the strong ones, man, you know. 
because when they got into the wilderness, a lot of them, you know, they couldn't take it, man. You know, they started complaining and they wanted to go back to Egypt. They wanted to go back into bondage because, you know, it wasn't it wasn't fun being in there, you know, <laughs> you know, to them, it wasn't fun, you know, but and the most I left him there for about 40 years. 40 years and that's what's happening to him right now man he couldn't take it nine years and he couldn't take it no more you know he couldn't take the truth so he's ready to sell everybody out you know and, and pretty much you know have him killed it's pretty selfish so he could go back to the way he was living that's like a lot of these guys right now man yeah. they got hit with reality and they're ready to sell you out so they could maintain their lives and go back to the way they were living you know what I mean Cowardly, man. Cowardly. These confidential informants out here. But yeah, man, you're gonna see in this clip. He tricked us. If you would have told us the truth, we would have told you to shove that red pill right up your ass. That is not true, Cypher. He set us free. Free. You called this free. All I do is what he tells me to do. If I gotta choose between that and the Matrix, I choose the Matrix. The Matrix isn't real. I disagree, Trinity. I think the Matrix can be more real than this world. All I do is pull a plug here, but there, you have to watch APOC die. Trinity. You know, but with everything, you know, the most I always had a reward for the wicked, man. You know, they could only go for so long. You know, and he got his, man. You piece of shit, you still gonna burn. <laughs> 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 